Hello YouTube. So all right guys, so if you're wondering why these cars are stacked and parked like crazy, so I actually came to Will's shop and it started hailing and I and I do have the clip of this crazy hail, so I'm I'm glad we managed to stuff the cars in last minute. So check out the bloody hail. came in my Corvette and this was also out and I was like holy shit it started bloody hailing and that's why it's all wet and damp I mean we're good with the rain but not with the hail so I thought I'll make a quick video because what we'll got was look at this so this one is a GD350 and I got really excited when when he told me that this car came for some jobs I'm gonna check from Will that what are we trying to do on the car but it's an orange gd350 and i thought it'll be a very interesting comparison with the 500 so i thought I'll, I'll take an opportunity so just look on the inside so yeah it's very much like i mean i know all the mustangs look the same i like the sweat so this has alcantara i think the 500 has all leather but rest everything looks the same it has nice recaros so these are very nice recaros they are cloth so yeah, these are completely cloth Recaros. Uh, yeah, not like the GD500. And as you know, this is a manual, guys. Yes, so it does come with a third pedal. You can see that. That's awesome. I know these cars are just a beast. I have not driven one. I would love to drive. The weather is bad, but hopefully if the weather gets nicer tomorrow, I'll probably take this one out for a drive and see how it feels. Let me just get inside. So yeah, it's it's an older style uh, instrument cluster. As you can see, it still has. Oh, let me start the car. I gotta. I've even forgotten how to drive manual. So let me press the pedal and. Oh wow, that's that's awesome. That's the gear. Okay, so that's on neutral. It's still on handbrake. This has a big giant handbrake, as you can see, and the GD500. This is an electric brake and the rotary dial. So I definitely like this one. I hope the car doesn't slide back. Yep. Let me see. Oh, wow. That's sound. Awesome. And this is the flat plane. I think it's a flat plane crank. Yeah. But it is the motor which revs all the way up to eight, nine thousand. So as you can see, let's see how. Oh, holy shit. Guys, this is amazing. So this is not the 350R this is the 350 so yeah i mean this is this is awesome guys i'm very excited about this car let me put it back on the gear uh yeah holy shit i suck in driving manual all right so it's now back let me just have a good look at the car it looks it's less wider than the 350 let's just have a back profile view yeah, the exhaust i like the diffuser beautiful car this is amazing one of my buddies by the way tracks this car he has it in austin and he tracks his 350 and i think he has a white uh with a heritage blue stripe and i've requested him that the next time he tracks uh, shares uh, he, he he gotta record some videos and clips for the channel so we'll have that soon uh, I, I hope to join him in the future as well but he mostly tracks in and around Austin area. So yeah, these are smaller Cobras. Uh, that's the older style Cobra. Now the Cobras are different, but I love this went. I don't know why they couldn't give it on the 500. They say, I mean, it doesn't need it, but I think it looks badass. Uh, the splitters are small because the 500 has an extra splitter. And I think even this area is very small. This one is much bigger on the 500 these are the wheels so these are not the carbon wheels these are the regular wheels the car is on i think this is michelin pilot sport super sport or sport 4s tires let's have a look so these are on michelin yeah i'm trying pilot super sport yeah because it's an older car guys and sport 4s are the newer tires so this is an older tire but yeah i mean i i, I love it 
how it looks so that's another older style cobra oh that's interesting this one is a newer style cobra this one oh so you know what there was no cobra i think they put it on here and they did not get the newer style cobras holy shit i don't know why they would do that because that's a different style cobra than what actually comes on these cars have a look so yeah that's that's bad <laughs> and these are the wheels so I, I i love this car it doesn't look like it has technology package because it has this and i don't know if they ever came with that so it doesn't it means it doesn't has blind spot uh that's the way to look at the blind spot now let's quickly go to the 500 because we have it right here so yeah that's the 500 i mean yeah this is my car i love it so <laughs> i'm not gonna throw shit on that but i think it's wider and and when i go to ford website i also see yeah this car definitely looks wider guys so this is wider and this is what i was talking about the splitters this is wide uh you see there's an extra panel and that piece is wider and these are carbon fiber wheels and by the way if you see will washing it so he's doing this is the second wash uh because right after this wash he's gonna look into all imperfections and stuff so he can he can fix them i'm planning to pick the car tomorrow so i'll have a video when i pick it up tomorrow so yeah guys i mean i i i, I love how this car looks and i mean i i enjoy the 350 as well that's orange that's the same color as my um zl1 so that's also an interesting color choice and it has classic black stripe i think it looks like yeah it's a painted stripe uh, it's not a painted stripe sorry it's a vinyl stripe and that's my corvette as you know i mean i love that car that's just a different beast uh, but yeah this is a good clip of both cars together let me just see if i get a nice view so yeah interesting weather guys it started hailing i'm glad it hasn't done any damage but i still have to go home and check what it did on my truck because i'm worried about what it might have potentially done to my truck uh, and and yeah look forward to the channel because i'll try and i'll see if the car is still here tomorrow i'll try to go on a test drive and give you a sort of a driving impression uh, that how does it compare with the 500 i mean it's just it's just for fun we know there's no comparison between a supercharged car and a naturally aspirated but just for the fun and the driving dynamics and the handling and all so look forward to that video and we'll, uh, yeah, we'll, I will see you in the next video. And please like and subscribe. Um, that helps the channel a lot. So if you haven't done that, please, please, please do that. And see you in the next video, guys. Take care.